So, this guy, he puts these, like, 12 adorable puppies in this heart-shaped box, okay? Uh, it serves Valentine. And he hands it to her, he gives it to her, and he says, he goes, Warning, may contain mutts. Because it, they're, they're chocolate labs. Oh! <laughs> they're chocolate lab pups, so it's like... The ch you know, chocolate nuts, right. uh, allergies. So funny. so funny. So you do this for a living? Yeah, I mean, I'm living. This is all so lovely. Oh, good. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's just a shelter, but thank you. Well, it's a shelter that your inheritance paid for, so. And it's nice to finally meet you, Roger. It's a pleasure. Glad we're finally doing this. Trey Bueno. Mmm, everything smells delicious. Can I help you bring in the food? No, I think we got it, right, Monica? Oh, do you wanna, uh... So, as you notice, there is no food, per just, se. Just wait, you guys are the, really gonna appreciate the table. this. Um, so when Monica told me that you two were coming, I thought, what can I cook for Monica's sister and brother-in-law? He asked that. I asked that. And uh, I was thinking and thinking, and I thought, I need some food for thought here. Bing bong, food for thought. Why don't we use our imaginations to really create what we're inheriting in our body, so to speak, and what we're not inheriting in our body, no MSG, no testosterone, no liquid nitrogen, no horse so urine. So we've prepared for you the healthiest, most delicious meal your imagination can muster. Also, this is a no impact meal. Totally no impact, super local. Local from the inside. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um. <clears throat> Mm-hmm. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I really taste the fennel. Yes. You know? Yes. I really taste the fennel. <laughs> yeah. Mmm. Oh, what is this? Foie gras, it's so good. Great choice. Um, what? We're, um, we're vegans, so... That's just disgusting. Um, it's just that, um, I'm, I don't know if, I don't know if you guys are aware of, um, what foie gras is. It's actually when they, um, kidnap geese and force feed them until their livers explode. They're mouth raped with food. Um, so it's actually worse than beef because it's worse than slaughter. It's a whole other thing. It's death by torture and there, um, there won't be any foie gras on the table tonight. Yeah. Did you say the geese are kidnapped? Yeah. Extraordinary say... rendition of these geese. These black site stuff vills. I, I would say so. Go to That's Guantanamo I goose. Yeah, I don't, I don't think geese are kidnapped. You can't, you can't. <laughs> can't kidnap an animal. You most right? an animal, certainly can. An animal is not a rational actor. Uh, right? An animal does not participate in the market, therefore an animal cannot be kidnapped. Trent, oh. I'm not angry. I just want you to be aware. So Trent, what do you do? Finance. Oh, me too. I have a Kickstarter account. Okay. So I know a little something about numbers if you ever want to just talk shop with one of the guys. Uh, Roger is starting his own business. Well, 
Yeah, yeah. We're thinking with my Jart and his experience sense of humor, in business. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be a really great year of the snake for us. Here's to here's to startups, right, guys? Yeah. This economy. Okay, I'm sorry, but I don't want to be rude. But is there going to be any food tonight? It's just that I'm. Uh, what I think uh, Trent is trying to, to say is that we just kind of thought. You don't like it, or? There's nothing to like. I'm sorry, Monica. I mean, this is just so. There's just nothing here. Creative. <sighs> yeah. So, anything could be here. You know, Trent. There are some people who can't eat at all. Okay. Yeah, like us. You know what, um, Monica, I really, really appreciate all uh, your creativity. And honestly, I really do. Uh, you, you told me about this, but you did not tell me about this. I'm sorry. What, what do you mean by this? I've lost my appetite.